Brandy, otherwise known as Mystery of Diamonds, and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, hey y'all. Okay, so, as you can see, I have a couple of unboxings, especially a canvas unboxing. So, that means that we have some new nails. Okay, camera, really? So, of the new nails, this, now, this is, it is a three-color gradient. You might not be able to see it as well, but it's all purples. Um, and I will be doing some designs on it later. Hold on, let me bring it back up. Um, and, and it, you might notice that this is not my normal, um, nail shape. That's because, since I'm going to be, for those that don't know, um, I will be opening an Etsy shop where I'll be uh, selling my nail designs um, uh, as well as uh, possibly my uh, hand-painted cover minders and stuff like that. Um, and so this is one of the nail shapes that I will be carrying, which is um, like medium coffin or what they call the ballerina nails. So I thought, you know... <laughs> Since I'm going to be carrying them, I might as well try them out myself, you know, because I've never had this shape on before. Now, I do plan on putting some actual designs possibly on here, um, but because I really want it to uh, kind of practice a little bit before I put them on here, um, and I want it to unbox this, uh, I want it to go ahead and just leave it like this, and I don't know, I may leave them, I haven't decided yet, but thinking on it okay so um before we get into this i okay i wanted to open this i want to go ahead and tell you yeah i've already opened it um i i i already looky looky sneaky peeky i couldn't help it um this comes to, to me from shine shop designs I, I i was so excited about these coming that i i i couldn't stand not looking at them okay y'all i'm so sorry but i did so now I want to show you guys what I got. Um, she has these really cool premium cover minders or, uh, that are like drill catchers. And I had to have some. Now, I had a little bit of a surprise, um, shall we say, when I opened this particular one. Because I had ordered um, a puppy in a cup. And so, when I got this one, I was, I was a little bit shocked. I was like, wait, wait, that's not my puppy. Did the puppy turn into an elephant? Um, but, I mean, this is absolutely cute. Now, it is a cover minder. See, it's got the really strong magnets here. Um, but, it, it also, okay. Nails, are you going to let me open it? There we go. But, see, it opens, and you can put, I'll probably end up putting my drills, maybe, in this section. I'm not real sure. Um, but, you know, you you open it, and you can use it as a drill storage. Now, you could technically do it that way um, if you want, but I'm probably going to put it on this side. And then you just, it closes it, and it has a magnet that closes it as well. And I do think that this is very, very cute. Look at that little elephant. Look at the bling on his truck and his ears. Oh my gosh. He is precious. Um, and so, you know, here's the thing. Even though she sent me out the wrong thing, um, I contacted her and I let her know, hey, uh, my puppy in a cup was not in the order. Instead, I got an elephant. Um, and you know what? Beth is really awesome that she does what she can to fix it. So she is sending me out the puppy in a cup. And she told me just to keep this one. Um, you know. And so, y'all, I'm extremely happy I get to keep this precious little baby. Okay. So that was one of them that I got. Um, the other thing that I ordered, I ordered kind of a while back. But I'm so glad it finally got here. I ordered this beautiful, uh, I forgot what she named it, but this beautiful red butterfly cover minder because, you know, I mean, this is, right, sturdy and, oh, is that not beautiful? 
oh i just i love it so yay i'm glad i got that one and then here is the other premium cover minder which yes i did actually order this one and <laughs> i oh y'all y'all i couldn't resist when i saw it i couldn't um because i saw it and my heart just melted it just melted and i said i was like i already cut you let me open it i couldn't resist it because like 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 look at that face look at the little hedgehog <laughs> Once again, it is a cover minder and it opens up. Now, I like this one because I can sit it like this. Oops. I can sit it like this on my canvas. Okay, see, it's not going to work for me right now because I'm, um, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. And I can put my drills in here, right? And when I put my drills in here and then um, when I'm moving on to the next project, I just, I close it and look. Whoop. Okay, now see, now it's going to make a liar out of me. Okay. Well, if you shake it too hard, it will open. <laughs> that's that's my bad. Okay. Um, but uh, I'm going to, I may have to look into uh, that. But I, I just won't shake it. That's what it is. I won't shake it. <laughs> no shaking the hedgy hog. Okay, sorry, sorry, baby. Um, I, I will just sit it on my canvas. I will open it up. I will put the drills in. I will close it and, and I will leave it. I won't turn it upside down. I'll just take it and set it to the side. And look, what's really cool is when they're not in use, <laughs> when they're not in use, they're just beautiful little babies to sit and watch you, right? So they, they work as perfect little little decorations okay okay so yeah i sorry i i had to get those and i wanted to open them why why because i want to use them <laughs> i want to use them i have a thing I, you know how people have a thing about cover minders and pens and stuff well i think i'm beginning to be uh attached to drill catchers um because like i have i have a trash can I have a bucket <laughs> I have now these I've got uh, another two coming um, I kind of want the beach pail I used to have the popcorn cup um, I, I put these to the sides so I have I don't know what it is but my obsession with with drill catchers but yeah I'm kind of that's becoming a new obsession of mine, especially these custom ones. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Hold on, y'all. I'm trying to fix my lighting because I don't know what's happening to the light outside my window. Okay. I'm back. So sorry about that. Trying to, I don't know what it is, but the outside light is just being a purple head over there. It's, it's coming in. It's just not coming in the way I want it. I may have to rearrange my room and end up putting this desk over there. But I really, I kind of like how my room's set up. Okay, okay, Ugh, enough of that. So, this canvas right here. Um, oh, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Before I get into this canvas, I forgot. Um, there is something I do need to talk to you guys about real quick. Um, Hanathon 1 uh, did just end. And I do have my weekly giveaways that I have to do. But here's the thing. There haven't been a lot of people that have commented on the lives that you needed to to be able to um, enter to win for that week for my giveaway, which it was the Pentastic Painters uh, pins with the butterflies on them. So here's the thing. I am giving you another opportunity if you did not go and watch um, those lives, the ones during April, my lives on Mondays, um, if you will go and, and you'll know that it's the one for the hand-on because I put um, like, I think pictures of Dahlia uh, for my uh, thumbnails uh, for my lives and it should be the last four. Okay, so if you'll go back, uh, go through and watch replay and comment on those, 
then I'll be able to pull and I'm, I'm going to give y'all a week. Okay. I'm going to give y'all a week and then I will, today is Sunday and then I will give you a week and I'll pull four winners, one from each week. Okay. With the comment picker. So if you have not seen those lives and commented on them, then now is your opportunity if you want to be able to win one of those weekly prizes. Okay, so now we're ready for this. This is actually starting off my new collab that I am doing with Kara from The Principal Painter and Mickey from Mickey Sunshine Creates. Um, we are doing a Micah Jelena event. So I've got purple nails. It's a smaller canvas. It's around. You can tell it's around because of this pink line right here. <gasps> and it's Micah Jelena. Do you know which canvas that I have? <laughs> I, I really, y'all, I have been wanting to do this canvas uh, for a very long time. And um, because, you know, I have done quite a few. Well, not quite. I've done two Micah Jelenas, um, both during collabs both with Kara. <laughs> yeah, there's something that Kara and I just love about Micah Zelina. Um, and so, uh, this is my third one, but it's a little bit of a deviation from the style that I've already done with her. So, I really, really wanted to do this. When I saw this, uh, I fell in love and I wanted to try it. So, I'm not going to show you the picture just yet. We're going to get this out. And I do realize that I, I should have already kitted this up yesterday. Um, but I was I was in the middle of nail making and I yeah, I, I kinda I, is there nothing is there something else in the box? Hello box. No, I don't see anything else in the box. Okay. Um and so I I'm a, I'm a day behind, but that's okay, because this bad boy is not only getting shown today, it's getting kitted up today, and it's getting started on today. So, yes. Yes, I'm getting it. Okay, so this is a regular toolkit. Okay, now, this one is one of the older canvases um, before they started doing the four placers in there and the small little pictures, because I bought this, like, when I saw it, when it came out. Um, and so your round tool kit is just like your square with one exception. It doesn't have the tweezers. It has the blue pen, the blue squishy, the clear boat, the two uh, heart waxes, some bags. Now this one, instead of a four placer, it does have a little three placer. But that's okay. That's okay. I've got plenty, so I'm not really concerned about that. Okay. I think I might can show this all on the camera i'm not 100 percent positive so i am going to show you the sticker so y'all want to see what i got i got satara <gasps> like look at that beautiful baby oh my god like i just yeah yeah i needed it i needed it so satara is a 61 by 41 round with a b's there are only 19 colors in Satara 19 um, and so uh, I'll be able to use my Harbor Freight to kit this up there is two ABs now with Diamond Art Club you know that they're ABs if the number here is up underneath 150 so we have 126 which is I think like a light purple and 141, which is that white AB. So I am curious to see how many we have. Um, this right here, if you don't know, now I know that the new ones are coming where the stickers already peel off for you, which is really cool. This one doesn't, but this is still a sticker sheet, okay? So I can still cut this and put these on my Harbor Freight, no problem. And then I keep this part to put in my journal my log book so okay i just i need to see the baby i need to see it oh. that's weird <laughs> usually it's usually it is sealed but look the little tabby is still on it i'm gonna leave the tab on it um because it doesn't need to seal it's coming out of the bag and it's staying out of the bag 
Ooh. Okay, I'm still trying to get around with these new <laughs> these new nails. Um, now, one of the things about Diamond Art Club that I do love, they have this special type of canvas that's called tarpaulin. Um, they are the only ones that have the tarpaulin. And it, it's really soft. Now, there are others that have soft, what in the world? There are others that have soft uh, backings, which is really awesome, but um, Diamond Art Club is the only one that has tarpaulin. All right, so I am going to get the drills out. Oh, oh, okay. The other thing that they send is a step-by-step -step instruction booklet that tells you some tips and tricks that you can use, and it gives you a 10% discount code for whenever you want to order again. That's one of the cool things about Diamond Art Club is that uh, there are multiple ways to get discounts. Like you get that book with every order. Uh, you actually get a discount code on the canvas and you get one on your shipping label. Like, like for reals, there's so many different ways to get um, things. Okay, so I am going to roll this the other way um this is poured glue and you can roll your canvases the other way with poured glue please do not do it with double-sided adhesive because if you do you are asking yourself to get rivers and bubbles um you can do it with poured glue because uh it's it's flexible that way okay and uh real quick before i unroll it one of the other things that i like about diamond art club is they have the scalloped edges, okay, um, for, and they have the surge protection with the, uh, I can't even think of what it's called right there, where they put this here and it's so that it will help uh, to keep your canvas from fraying. Okay, so here we go. Oh, look at her okay let me see if I can get up any higher oh so look at this beauty oh my god can you believe this like she is gorgeous I mean I don't know if it's a she uh, but I mean you know, her name's Satara right isn't that a she I love big cats and this leopard is just gorgeous like look at these eyes oh my god and all this purple y'all i love the color purple um it is like something that i really love there is a lot of black there is a lot of black in this so what i can tell in this is that there are moments of confetti now what is confetti confetti is where you have um a lot of different colors in one spot um, but you also have tons of moments of color blocking, which color blocking is where you have the same color in lots of spaces and you can multi-place. One of the cool things about multi-placing with, um, black drills is that you don't really see that, that, uh, separation, uh, of, if you have a white background, um, it's really hard to multi-place because you're going to see it. Through, I don't know why, I don't know how, but like it just happens. And so if I've got white backgrounds, I don't multi-place anymore. I used to until I saw what one looked like. And yeah, I, it changed my tune altogether. Um, so like I said, this one has a ton of multi-placing. As, as I can see, um, there's a lot of black in this. So I am expecting... Uh, quite a few uh, black drills like I said this is only a 61 by 41 canvas uh, so it's not super huge okay um, this is going to give me uh, the freedom because I do have another canvas that I'm working on plus I'm working on uh, getting some nails for my shop um, so I wanted to be able to have something that was manageable for me. And, and I just, this one just called out to me. She just kept going, I want to be worked on because I want to see all these purples. Oh, I want to see all these purples. Okay. So, um, real quick, I want to look at, before I look at the drill field, um, while I've got you up. So our two ABs are number one and number two. So, number one, let me see, number one is all, it's going right here, outlining these uh, 
parts right here, hold on, right here, um, which are like whiskers. Let's see. Oh, and you've got some over here. You have some within the ear. Oh, you have parts going in different little spots um, all along the face. Wow. Oh, my gosh. Um, there's some ones going up here around the eyes, so that's going to highlight the eyes. Uh, you have some ones here in the muzzle. Do you have any ones down here? Oh, my gosh, like big patches. So there's going to be like patches on the face of that uh, light purple AB. And then for the number two, um, all there's like there's twos all here in the eye placed periodically throughout the face um i don't see a, a little bit right here uh there there are a few twos um out here in the the part out here um and in little highlighted spots down here in here so there are ones and twos scattered throughout this canvas so i do think that this canvas will Oh, it's going to turn out beautiful. Okay, so I cannot wait to see the drills. But before we do, I want to show you the drill field. All right, first off, it is sticky. I have never, ever worried about a sticky canvas um, from Diamond Art Club. Uh, and I will tell you, when you see that there's, uh, like, something... Uh, where it looks like it's a bubble, it's not, okay? It's just in the plastic, okay? You see the glue is perfectly fine. There's nothing wrong with it. All right, so give me a second, and I'll bring you down into the drill field. Okay, so hopefully you can see this drill field is very, very clear. Like, I've never worried about um, the drill field in Diamond Art Club. Their drill field is always where you can see perfectly fine. Um, now, I have had some people say, well, you know what? They have those little guide circles. That means that they have um, little circles going around the symbols. I'm going to say yes and no. Okay, are there little circles going around these? Okay. There are, but they are very, very light, okay? Now, do you still want to be careful placing your drills? Well, yeah, if you're, especially with the light ones, but, I mean, I tell you, like, you, I've, I've never had any issues with theirs, you know, showing through and doing bad because, like I said, they're very, very light. Um, it, it, it does not bother me at all in the least. I've, like I said, I've never had, and I've done quite a lot of Diamond Art Club canvases, but I do love how absolutely clear that it is. Like, look at that. These symbols. Um, now, I always use a light pad. That's just me. I, I light my light pad. It doesn't matter how clear the symbols are. I use a light pad. Um, and so, but this is one of those that you would not need a light pad if you did not want to do it. Um, Y'all look at those ones and days. All right, so let me pull you up, and we'll get to looking at the, the colors. All right, so we have just a small little tray. Now, um, something else to let you know. If you store your drills separate from your canvas, it does have the name of the canvas on here, Satara. Um, like I said, this is round. So are we ready to go down to Crinkle Town? Let's go down. Let's go down. And I'm not even going to put them back in this bag because uh, as soon as this video is over, I'm going to be kitting this bad girl up. All right. I'm not used to just such a small little train. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> All right. So it looks like these are our three tins. Okay. Um, so we have one two, three, four, five, six. We have six bags of three tens. All right. Then let's look at this. this see, there's only two trains in the entire kit. Oh my God. <sighs> I think this probably has to be my first Diamond Art Club that has the smallest uh, number of colors, which is awesome. All right, so we have 210, which is this really pretty lavender. 
We have 550, which happens to be like one of my favorite purples. I was trying to get this to show. Okay, hold on. Okay, I'm not sure why my lighting refuses, even though I have LED lighting on to show. Because 550 on the camera kind of looks like it's blue. It's not blue. It's purple. Like it's the purple that's in my nails. But ugh, okay, camera just don't want to show it. We have 550, which is one of my favorite colors of purple. And then we have 209, another light lavender. Oh, we got two of those. And then we have 3837. It's another. I mean, this whole thing is purple, y'all. Uh, we have 208. We have two of those. We have 333. Look how pretty that is. We have 327, another purple. And here is that purple AB126. Now, I keep saying AB. What is that? AB stands for Aurora Borealis, okay? And it just means there is this coating on the drills where it's got this um, iridescent coating right there. So, like, you see how you can see how that's different from that one. Um, and it just makes the drills shine um, more, and then here's our 141, which is the white AB. Okay, so there's your two ABs right there. And then we have, what is this, a light gray, 762. We have a little bit darker gray, 414. Here's another gray, 318. Another gray, 415. So I'm assuming those grays are in like the muzzle and stuff instead of white. And then we have 312, which is a pretty blue. And then we have 3799, which is a very dark gray. 3371, which is a, that's a brown. That's, that's deep dark chocolate. And then we have this light blue, 334, and another light blue, 3755, that has uh, some little, little partiers hanging out with it when they weren't supposed to. Okay, so... Let me turn this back over. I'm looking forward to this. This is, oh, this is going to be so pretty. And this is finally, you know, like usually when I unbox something, I'm kind of like, oh, I cannot wait to do it. Well, guess what? I get to do it. Yay, yay, yay. Okay, so, huh, I'm sorry. This has been a little bit of a long video, but I hope that you have stuck with me. And if you have, thank you so, so much. I so appreciate you guys. But um, the hashtag for our event is hashtag Micah Mania, um, and I will put that on the screen down here, um, and we wanted the word May, you know, because this is May, so Micah May, M-A-Y-I-N-A, -A. Micah Mania 2021, 20, I think, I will double check and make sure, like I said, I will have it up here um, on the screen for you, um, and all we're really wanting, guys, is we are wanting for you to uh, post what you're doing on Instagram on the hashtag. Um, we will be going live at different points, um, like together. Like I'm going to be working on her in my live on Monday, um, tomorrow at seven o'clock central. Um, and, uh, but then, um, we're also going to have where we're going to each go into each other's lives um, uh, once during the month or actually maybe twice for, for the ending. Um, and then we're also doing whip and chat. Um, and what we're doing is each of us is doing a different whip and, ch whip and chat a week. So the first week, this week is going to be Mickey Sunshine's uh, whip and chat. Next week will be my whip and chat. And then the following week will be Kara's. And then... We will be doing the uh, giveaway. We are doing um, $25 gift cards to Diamond Art Club. So you want to make sure that you are uh, commenting and stuff um, because we are really looking forward. We want it to try to make it as easy as possible. There is a link, though, um, our form that you need to fill out so that we do have your information to be able to send you uh, your information, uh, your stuff. So, uh, I will have that in the description below. Okay, so are you guys ready to start Micah Mania 2021? Okay, so I hope so. I hope that you've enjoyed this video. 
Um, if you have, please click that like button down below. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, I would love for you to subscribe and become part of the Diamonds family. Just remember to hit that bell notification, bell icon for all notifications so that you know anytime I upload a video and whenever I go live, which like I said, is normally on Mondays at 7 o'clock Central Standard Time. All right, well, I'm going to leave you like I always do. Reach for the stars, grab hold, hold on, and never let go. Until my next video, bye guys.